Hi, I'm Mitch from Single Trail, and today we're going to show you how to assemble your Single Trail rack. When your rack arrives, you'll receive three boxes. The tools you require to assemble your rack are either two adjustable shifters or two 13mm spanners and a 17 and a 16mm spanner. The first step you want to do is open the box with the pivot and the mast and take the pivot off the mast. With your pivot off the mast, go ahead and insert it in your car and you use the supplied pin to fix it into place. Located on the underside of the tongue is the bolt for the anti-wobble mechanism. Take a 16mm spanner, either the one supplied or your tools, and fasten it. The next step is to take the mast and the two M10 by 90 bolts with four washers and two nuts and install the mast. The next step is to take a 16 and 17 mil spanner and tighten the mast bolts. Bolts tighten, you can step on the foot pedal and put the rack into the forward position for the rest of the assembly. Next, take the rear bar to install and ensure it's facing so that the loops are on the top side of the rear bar. Place it onto the mast and use the two M8 bolts Take two 13mm spanners and fasten the bolts for the rebar. To assemble the top bar of the bike rack, space your wheel baskets out on the ground, leaning over to the right, and take the top bar with the single trail sticker upside down, also on the right side. To fasten each basket to the top bar, take two M8 by 50 bolts one washer and one nut. For the wheel baskets, only a washer is required on the nut side. Take two 13mm spanners and tighten all the bolts for the wheel baskets. The last step is to install the wheel baskets and top bar onto the mast. Take the last two M10 bolts. This step might be easier with a friend so they can help you line up the bolt holes. Just ensure the overhang and the sticker are on the left hand side. Take your 16 and 17 mil spanner and tighten the bolts for the top bar. Our V3 pivot has three positions it can travel in and it can also be laid down fully. To operate your pivot, place your foot on the foot pedal and press it to allow you to adjust the angle. There are three left positions and the rack can lay down fully. When you've finished and want to put the rack back into the upright position, simply lift it and the rack will automatically lock. The easiest method to pick up your bike is to grab the crown and the top of the seat tray and pick up your bike. Fasten the bike in the rack, take the loop and place it over the pedal and then pull the rope, ensuring that the crank is in line with the rope. To release the rope, lift the lever up, pull the rope through and then remove the loop from the pedal.